Jared Poland. Jared Poland. Frono's photo. Dot com and welcome back to another Squarespace Rapid Fire Critique where I take one of your websites and give it a critique. I'm your critiquer. So now right before we get into that, if you're looking to build your own website and online presence, please check out squarespace.com slash fro to get a 14-day free trial to see if you like using Squarespace. It's what I use for jaredpoland.com. If you like it, please use the code fro at checkout to get 10% off your first year or month. Use the code fro. So here we go. We've got Humble Lion which I was trying to read it before, and I was like, humble lion, humble lion photography. Uh, let's see, where time is frozen and memories are created. Ugh, the cheese factor on those taglines are cheesy. Anyway, this is not built on a Squarespace platform. This is built on something else. I'm not really sure. I don't, right off the bat, oh, let me go back to the main page. I just hit back. Uh, right off the bat, I just, I don't like the black. It just comes across, like when I come to a website, I want to see your photos before, please call us for a free quote. Um, our main goal is to create lifetime memories our clients can share. Okay, we get that, like I get it. There are so many cliche taglines that you're gonna see on this site. Um, I'm, not just, I'm not just ripping, I'm just pointing that out because that's what I see, but I just don't like the website that comes across as just straight up dark. It doesn't, and like even this image of thank you at the top, comes across, I want to see the image bright. I don't want to see it gradated and lost. Um, same thing down here. I want to see photo shoot going down at platinum, whatever that means. Like, I want to see this. I, I, I'm clicking. I, I can't see it. I can't see anything because it's not there. Um, but I like the testimonials. I like the fact that they're there. I like the scrolling. This is really nice. It's a great way to see a testimonial. Somebody says something, um, you scroll through it. I like that. It's, it's white, it's vibrant. Uh, I just don't like the dark looks on a website. I, I, I think when I'm hiring a photographer or looking for a photographer, I want to see vibrance. Not, not always just saying screaming at you in your face vibrance, but I, just, I don't like the dark look. If you like the dark look, explain why you like it. This is just my personal preference and my critique of it, but we all have our personal preferences. So if you like it, of course you like it. Um, Humble Lion Photography, uh, mission statement. Our mission here at Humble Lion Photography is to create lasting, and by the way, I haven't gotten to a photo yet. The first things that I'm, I'm seeing on this page are not photos, I wanna see photos. Um, lasting memories with pure passion and enthusiasm. We capture these moments like never before. I don't understand what that never before means. You capture moments like never before, like nobody's ever captured them before, or what? Um, and determined to, to handle each and every client in a family-like manner. That's great. That makes you feel humble and good. Uh, humble lion photography is where time is frozen and memories are created. I, time is frozen and memory. I mean, I get it, I guess. I capture, uh, I, I guess. Founder, Andrew Humble, good game. Uh, humble, humbled, published photographer. Creativity is the only thing I strive for when I'm behind the camera. Uh, the art in which I deeply admire is in the eyes, not the gear. We enjoy creating memories for our clients. So right here, look, it has one person on here. What I'm going to say on the about page is stop this we stuff. Say I. You even say I in the about who you are as the founder, but then you go into we. There is nothing wrong with you owning that it's yours. My photos, the photos I capture are lasting memories. They're frozen in time and blah, blah, blah. But get rid of this we unless there really is a we. I don't see a we, I see a you. And there's nothing wrong with that being just you. Talk to people like that. I'm gonna come and capture your day and, and freeze those memories for all time to be for now and forever and any other Peebo Bryson song I could think of. But be it, like own that, be, be you. Don't worry about saying we. Like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't worry about that. All right, contact, hey, look, we're still not at photos. I still don't want to contact you because I still haven't seen a photo. Now we get to sample work. All right, now we get to see the work. I'm clicking, I'm clicking. Why isn't it going to the next image? There we go, now it's moving. All right, so we're seeing the images that you capture. We're getting a, a, a cross section of what you do, that's fine. I despise this. 
is this a solo cup ad? Like, I do not, I, I think, all right. And get rid of, and the Humble Lion f photography in the bottom corner doesn't need to be there. Um, I, yeah, no, the, the Humble Lion photography doesn't need to be there. Um, let me get back to that selective color thing. It looks horrible. It looks cheesy. It looks like you're trying to make an image better than what it was if it wasn't good. And in this case, showing solo cup shots that are red with the girl's red glasses, it, it, it's cheesy. It's like 1990 all over again. It's like photos by Deb. I'm just pointing it out as I see it, and I don't want to have to defend myself for this, but I, I just think it's cheesy. Don't do it. Don't, don't, try to, don't try to make a photo better because, because it's like... Um, delete this photo, please, quickly, humble lion. I humbly request that you delete this photo quickly because this does not represent your work. You have better work than this. This is out of focus. And you selectively colored the flowers. I don't, I look at this and I go, I'm not hiring you because why, this is like, I could have done that with my cell phone. You got to get rid of that photo. That's, that's better. All right, we're capturing moments. We got bubbles. All right, good. We've got some stuff going on with creative crops. So there's some all right stuff. There's some better stuff. There's some stuff that I would get rid of. That's very nice right there. The shoes look good. There you go. Yeah, nice. Yeah, they're happy. Oh, no. Get off the train tracks. Get off the train tracks. Again, I'm gonna bring up this train tracks thing. Get off the freaking train tracks. If somebody comes to you and says, I wanna take pictures on train tracks, you say no. And if you come up with the idea for shooting tra on train tracks, you tell yourself no. I will not shoot on train tracks. Dangerous for one. I these look like open train tracks. They don't look like train tracks that aren't in operation. This is stupid. Stay off the train tracks. You're putting yourself and your client in harm's way. You're going to be dead. Don't do this. I'm just going to skip through. All right. Way too many photos in this gallery. Way too many photos. You got to separate this sample work. It's not sample work. Like, sample work makes it seem like it's not worthy for what you're showing. Split your stuff into wedding photos, family photos, uh, car photography, because it seems like you got car photography going on. So split it up into the galleries that you want to put in there. Don't put it under sample, photo, sample work. Call it photography. Call it portfolio. Galleries. It's going to come across better. And so split your galleries into the best of the best work without ones that are out of focus and color, uh, spot selective color. Um, oh, and there's galleries over there. So I guess don't call it galleries, call it portfolio or sample images. Well, no, don't call it sample images. Call it portfolio. So we've got weddings, photography services. If you're interested in, prof in a professional photographer who will capture all of your special moments and give a keen approach to details that humble, humble, humble Lion Photography is here for you. We bring, again, we bring our resi uh, resilience, that's what it says, in your images, I don't know what that means, and deliver them in a prompt and profound, okay, good. Get rid of the we, it's you. You're a professional photographer who's gonna capture these, not we. So good, we're showing this stuff. Be basic service prices. All right, you want to post it? That's fine. Compare service packages and find the best that fits for you. Wedding. Contact us for quote. I do not like 100% satisfaction guaranteed. What are you going to do if they're not happy? What are you going to do? Give them their money back? Like, don't set yourself up for things like that. You need to protect yourself. If they're not happy, you need to have a recourse. But what does 100% guarantee mean? Like in photography, what's that mean? You shoot their wedding and the photos aren't good, and what are you guaranteeing? You're gonna give them money back? But uh, no, no, I'm not. I'm not a fan of that. Portraits, all right, fine. Uh, events, fine. You list it, that's fine. Print sold separately, fine. Sample galleries or galleries. 
the Clarks view gallery, which I'm not a fan that you can view somebody's stuff, even if you can view just their image, um, shootproof.com. Open gallery? Okay, at least it says email and password. That's good. But I, would, I don't even like getting to the part where I see the family. I shouldn't, want, I shouldn't see that, especially for something like that. You should be giving people a direct link to a gallery that's not posted on your site. Um, I, this is a tough one, obviously, because I'm, 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 I'm a little more harsh on this one. I think deservingly so, but that's what a critique is because hopefully Humble Lion Photography can take some of the things I've said here and tighten it up and make it better. I'm going to recommend that this person goes and tests out a Squarespace site at squarespace.com slash fro, use the code fro, whatever. Get your 14-day free trial. You're going to make your site more vibrant, more likable, uh, and beyond that, you need, to pick your you need to split up your galleries. You need to put things into different portfolios so that people can see the distinctive types of work that you do. You say that you do events, you say that you do portraits, you say that you do weddings. Well then put together a wedding portfolio, an events portfolio, and a, and a, and a what was the other thing? Uh, 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 events, weddings, and portraits. Put together those three things into their own separate galleries, pick the best 15 to 20 images that are in focus, not out of focus, and don't do selective color, and put those up there and get a cleaner looking, get rid of the black. It's just dark, it's dark. And anytime I wanna see, I wanna see images vibrant. I wanna see them like right there in my face. I wanna see good quality images and that's what's gonna make me wanna hire you. Get rid of the third person t talking like we. There, there is no we, or not third person, just the we stuff. There's no reason for it, it's you, own it. You're the photographer. I love coming to, ca I love capturing your images. You can trust me to capture amazing photos of your event, done affordably, done professionally, done like you're my own family. I would photograph you as if you're in my family. Like, own that stuff. There is no other we. There's no other people that I can tell from the site. Um, so if you want your own square, if you want your own critique, uh, the link is down below. I think it's uh, bit.ly dot dot ly slash fro critiques. If you can handle it. I'm gonna just be me. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna say it like it is, as as I see it fit, as I see fit to it. Um, the last thing I'll say is, if you want to try Squarespace, go to squarespace.com/fro to get your 14-day free trial. If you don't like it, don't use it. If you do like it, use the code fro at checkout to save yourself some money. Uh, that was a hard one. Ja I'm gonna leave. Jared Polandfronosphoto.com. See ya.